Hey, what's up YouTube? Another challenging mission that I just um, was going to surrender to. But this is a, a rear diffuser in carbon fiber for the Ferrari F430. And it's about $2,000. So I want to protect it. Um, not that it needs a whole lot of protecting, but I want to keep it looking pretty too. Um, the original, of course, I've put on myself um, probably eight or 9,000 miles on it. And it doesn't have much... Um, damage to it at all however the carbon fiber it's you know way prettier i want to keep it looking pretty so yeah i bought some bulk 3m venture shield film from an online retailer and tried putting it on uh, one gigantic piece yesterday i spent four hours um attempting it and i miserably failed and threw it all away and was just gonna surrender and hire some pros to do it well, I text messaged a couple of pros in town and neither of them wanted to do it because there's no templates or pre-fit, pre-cut panels that they could buy and put on. So, of course, if there's pre-cut um, film, I could just easily do that myself, but um, there's not. So, no one wanted to do the job and they said it's impossible. Forget it. I started with this side here um, because it's the outer edge. The wheels are probably going to kick up more sand and dirt it's probably gonna hit the outer edges first so i thought i would try that and what i did was i blue taped the film down and then i traced around it with my uh, exacto knife and i cut um, as nice as i could around it and i actually went over it so um, this took me about maybe a half hour to do this small side here and it is on there as you could tell the seam is right there so it is definitely doable if you just take your time then I said, you know, I want to challenge myself a little more with the new skills I learned. And I wrapped the top of this and I laid a big piece all the way across here. And I taped it down in the back with some blue tape down there. And then I took the razor blade and I cut along here and I cut this section and I separated all of this off and all of this off and I cut this out here and this is what the template looks like um, of course this is the, the the side that's facing the the front of the car so it goes like this okay that is how it was cut and I originally thought that I would need these corners cut so I could bend it in easier without um, crinkling it up but on this side I did not do so and I wish I would have tried that first because this side's nice and smooth and there's no triangles cut out of it this side because I'm limited in film left you could see I've got some triangles cut out and I hopefully when it dries this air bubble thing here will be gone um, but it's only been about a half hour since I stopped. And I was so excited. I thought I would share with you guys. Um, but this is not going to be visible to the naked eye once it's on the car. It's under, this is underneath facing the ground. So you'll get to see, you know, this side up here more um, when the car's on display or parked or whatnot. So anyways, just want to share with you guys that it is doable. I searched YouTube long and hard to find someone that actually did um, videos on how to go around nice corners or really sharp corners like this to do and I really couldn't find anyone um, and so I'm gonna do this all by myself and maybe I'll post a picture or two when I'm done uh, with the finished product but yes I'm gonna PPF pretty much all of this and it's gonna take many hours but I am going to do this thanks for watching guys